Well here we are at St Andrews Beach on the Mornington Peninsula. A fantastic golf course built by Tom Doak. Uh, just perfect golf course country. This is all sand dunes until you can see no further. Then on the other side of that is the, uh, the ocean. So uh, it's a great golf course. First hole here is 495 meters. That's uh, f about 540 odd yards. And it's into the slight breeze. And uh, when you hit down this fairway, nice wide fairway looks like it from here, but certainly for a, a high handicap golfer, you wouldn't want to uh, uh, hit the ball low. You wouldn't want to duff it off this tee. Mm. You got about 150 yards to the fairway. Uh, and uh, pretty intimidating for someone that's on a higher handicap, but this is the back tee, this is the black tees. Uh, there are tees down forward, so the, the higher handicap golfer can still really enjoy their game. Right, let's, uh, let's see it, Pete. <laughs> so Get let's us see underway. It. Okay, so that's enough, uh, enough beforehand, so let's see. Enjoy the hit. We're up and running. It's uh, really a pleasure to be here. take that for a first shot. Yeah, you're happy with that one, Pete. Yeah, no, it's uh, great to be here. I, I'm, this sort of golf course really uh, invites you to play golf. Easy does it, just like that. Just tap it down. You know good golf's yeah. easy, don't you? I do. Okay. What a great day here on the Mornington Peninsula, eh? Perfect for golf. Just a gentle breeze. Tell you what, that's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I got on that one. Yeah, no, I've, I've seen you hit it further, but boy, for a first shot off of the hole like this, I, I'm very impressed. Find my team, we're, we're on the way. I think you might have hit that tee out of bounds. <laughs> there it is, I see it. Okay. Well, Jake, uh, second shot, par five. Yep. We're looking here. Going over the ridge, and uh, yeah. you can't get that bunker. No, so. so just tap it somewhere in front of them. Yeah, the middle of those bunkers is the perfect line for you. Okay. Mate, that's a fantastic shot. Pulled it a bit. Yeah. But the nice thing is over there's okay. There's no yep. there's plenty of room on this hole. Yeah, there certainly is. Hey, but you hit it super. <laughs> Impressed. Uh, basically I'm about 225 plus yards to those bunkers, so into this breeze. I feel I uh, hit just a nice shot, I'll come up just short. And I'm just going a little bit to the right. Give me a bit better look if I can see the pin from out there. I'll take that. That's uh, that's the shot, Pete. Yeah, goody. Short of the bunkers, good. Well, Jake, uh, here we are, third shot, and yeah. you're, you're just unfortunately just got on the edge of the rough. Yeah. Thought it was in the fairway, but uh, now you're over the top of that. Uh, once you get to that bunker there, it's uh, about 50 yards yeah. on the other side that is the flag, yeah. and it's just just inside the left edge. Yeah. And you got about 100, 110, it's 160 yards from here to yeah. there. What, what club are you playing, I've buddy? Got a six. Six iron, yeah. okay. And the lie here. It's pretty good, it's pretty <laughs> wispy grasp. Yeah. Catch a little bit. Well, the whole idea here is to hit down on that ball. Yeah. You know, so a six iron, 
you're pretty strong so make sure you, you hit down throw that club head down into that ball play it back in your stance a little the next time you get another opportunity I do. okay I think it might be the same club Just lean a little bit on your front foot, okay, when you play this shot. Uh, rough's always tough. Miss the bunk. Come on, miss it. Oh. Anyway, mate, good experience, good learning experience. Okay, Jake, this is a bit of a shot, a blind shot, but I know it's just over the the top of this bunker here, in the middle of this. I got about 120, 125 yards into the wind. I'm going to punch an 8 iron. pushed it a bit just didn't release it fully well here we are third shot for no actually fifth shot for Jake he's in this bunker and he's probably got about 75 yards to the pin okay buddy it's all yours What a great shot. Boy, oh, backspin as well. You're about 10 feet from the hole. Super duper. Normally, uh, probably from this distance, just off the green, the, gr the grass is fairly short. You'd have a choice of putting it, but with this uh, little uh, water uh, sprinkler here, I can't do that. So I've got, I'm just looking at it. It's very important when you get these shots, a bit of a bit of a shoulder here so I really have to hit the hit it way up here probably got about 10 foot of borrow in it if I put the line from where I got to aim I got to aim 10 feet to the right of the hole or thereabouts maybe 15 feet okay I'll use a chip and runyon poor runyon's way of doing it the putting stroke Here's a chance to uh, recover the score a bit. Wow, great putt. Knock that in, Pete. Yeah, it's nearly a gimme. <laughs> no gimmies in this game. That's right. This is a great opportunity to practice your technique and your routine. Right in the middle. Oh well, it's just a little bit high, a little bit hard. What a pity. Never mind. Next one.
radio. Next hole. Okay, hole two, Pete. Hole two, this is uh, 279 yards. Short par four, but interestingly, they've got a bunker stuck right in the middle of the fairway, and it's just about the distance I carry it, so it really short, it tightens up the hole. Uh, right to left breeze. It's a great little hole. It's, it doesn't have to be a long hole to be a, a tough or a good test of golf. So what I see is, I think I'll just, uh, I'll hit it just to the left edge of the bunker and it should kick around. Plan, plan A. That should be pretty good. Yes, uh, position A again, that's okay. I'll get a good shot at the flag. Okay, Jake, uh, 279 yards, but you're, you're doing a smart thing. You're playing your four iron. Yeah. Hit it in the fairway and it wedge it like, on. It looks like for, from here, it seems to all funnel back down into the same area anyway. And further on, you've got a bunker here, you've got a bunker on the right, you've got a bunker on the left. So it seems like the face option, safe option for me is it's short. Yeah. 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 Yeah, that's a smart way. Pitching wedge in for your second. Oh, lovely shot. Mate, you're hitting it like a pro. Tell you what, I wish I could hit my four iron that straight and that far. Beautiful. So what's your secret, mate? I've got a good coach, Pete. Oh, that's a good start. <laughs> well, Jake, this is a quite a nice looking shot. The, yeah. There's more room on the right on of the, the flag. Right. Yep. Yeah, that's yep. probably, and the wind, wind's coming a little bit from the right. Yeah, and I've also on a bit of a, got a bit of an uphill lie or a sideways lie here, so I'm gonna aim. I'm going to aim pretty much center of where I think the green is and it will probably come a little bit in off with that breeze and with this line actually. See that, uh, that, see that marker up there on the yep. right? That yep. white marker? Yep, up the top. Yeah, about 10 feet, 15 feet inside that's your line. Yeah. And if you hit it solid the wind will bring it in, it will run in from that side. Nice shot. Might be a little right, but I think it'll be it'll be safe and on the green. Middle of the green. Yeah. Gee, you, you, I'm impressed. You must be practicing. <laughs> now, what I'm saying about this shot, Jake, is it's uphill into the wind, coming from the right side. I've got 80 yards, 81 yards to the pin. Ball's a little bit above my feet, and, it's, and I've got an uphill lie. So uh, normally, I'd probably play a gap wedge. But what I'm going to go back to my wedge because it's going to go up higher in the air just off that upslope. And again, I'm going to also, like you, play a little bit to the right hand side. Solid. It's on the flag. Maybe just a little left of the flag. I'm oh, happy with that shot. Okay, so here we have the hole here. There's a nice little bank here, so mine actually kicked in off the bank. So a bit of local course knowledge would have helped my shot, but I was lucky. Well, all I know is I ate that ball way too far. <laughs> And uh, a good test of, I want to move this, you, you put this Sorry, I did, to, sorry Pete. It probably could help, it's a break. I was, um, 
I've got to make sure you don't put something like mm. that, otherwise if I hit it's a penalty. But I'm not going to go that far. No, that's, what I, that's why, why I put it there. Yeah, no, I'm <laughs> definitely it's uh, downhill, uh, quite a lot of coming in from the left side. Far to the left before it came back. Anyway, just a good tester for me for the next one. Hope you learnt something from my putt there, Jake. Yeah. I definitely didn't see it coming off the first bit of the hill. That's where you should take a little extra time to read both brakes. What a nice putt. Go in. Beautiful. Great distance control. That was pretty pretty much downhill too. It was, it was a long way down here. Okay. This is your bread and butter. This is for a half. Otherwise you're gonna win the hole. I better. I got it. Yes! Great putt. Oh, that was a bit of pressure. <laughs> okay. Okay, Pete, now this is an intimidating hole. Well, not really, if, you, if you're long and straight. But uh, what it is, is great. This very open, linksy land. Uh, this one opens it up so up to the wind. If you look at this hole down here uh, with the wind like that, uh, the idea is to hit a little bit left to centre. That's the, uh, the safe side. And then just approach it in 445 yards. That's quite a decent par four mm -hmm. into, into a slight breeze, left to right. Okay, relax, enjoy. Well, Pete. That's, uh, that didn't play it. It went a little further right than I wanted to. But uh, it'll open up. I can get a good shot at it from there. Okay, Jake. Uh, play it a little bit on the left side, eh? And enjoy the hit. Oh, absolutely super. It's a long way down there, that shot, and you'll be that'll, you'll enjoy that. The second shot in is, ma is a magic shot into this hole. Open tee shot, but the second shot's really mm -hmm. something special. Well, this shot here, uh, I've got 217, 220 yards to the pin, and it, uh, the green's in that little V, v section there, so I know that uh, left side's a little bit better than the right, so I'm going to go at the left edge with this cross breeze. 
three wood. Take that, baby. <laughs> yeah, the, <laughs> just get it's there. kicked on left. It took the brake, did it? it? It did. It kicked on to the left. It's probably five to ten yards left of the pin. But well, um, all I can tell you I'll is tell it, you what. It's, it's a relief. Doesn't matter who you are. To, this is a very intimidating hole. <laughs> when you hit a three three wood in, in between that uh, thread, the needle. Those two. Uh, very heavily uh, grasped mounds, I, I'm quite happy. <laughs> Very happy. Well, Jake, you're swinging so smoothly, but I, I really didn't want to mention this, but you're about 30 yards in front of me. Now, isn't it interesting, you're over here, you got a, you got a blind shot. Yeah. It was a really super drive. But, uh, you know, you can just see the flag flapping yeah, just on the can. edge. Yeah, yep, just the, the tip of it. Yeah. So, what club have you got? You've got 190 yards to go. Took out a five. Okay, so um, from, from where you're hitting, you're a little bit down breeze. Yeah. So yeah. It's, it's not a big five for you, I don't think. Ah, okay. Just and I'm just gonna like my my aim. I think I'm just on a on a slightly down. Uh, it's blowing my feet a little bit, so I might aim probably the tip of that tree. That is it a moona tree? Uh, on the left side here. Yeah, on the left side on that on the mound above the bunker. Yeah. Okay. So that, they're just the left edge of the just bunker. The very tip. Yeah. Now, the main thing I'd say, uh, just watch the ball and hit, really stay in the shot, you know, yeah. commit to the hit, we'd say. What a shot. Sit down, baby. Yeah. You're not supposed to hit it that far. But it's on the green, back of the green. The trees, the, um, the bush behind it. It went that far? Yeah. That's 220 yards, that bush. Mate, you, you just don't know your own strength. That's the problem with you strong guys. And, that's, and you hit it so well. I don't think it, I can't get that far. Anyway, we'll get up there. If you get up there quick, we might, it won't be that far. <laughs> Now, mate, this is a uh, this is fair dinkum. Uh, this this shot here is you're robbed. You know, you just gone over the pretty well over the pin, and you bounced from just out here, and you've gone down into this deep rough. Now, the dilemma here is if you're playing a tournament, you've got a decision to make: whether you take an unplayable lie out of that the ball's way down deep in there. Yep. Or if you did take an unplayer, well, you, you can't really get a spot in the rough that's, that's within two club lengths. That's yeah, no, nah, nah, exactly. So you'd have to go all the way back to where you hit the other shot from. But, uh, you know, we're out here having a friendly game. Yep. Knock her out. I'm not going to give it to you. I want to see how good you are. <laughs> okay. Now, look. Now, meanwhile, I just don't want to mention it, but you see how, how nice a shot I played yes, in there? Yes, yeah. Okay. Yes. Hey, that's okay. We'll okay. just um, we'll get up and down from here. Yeah, you could have played a you could have played a seven iron from where you were. Mm. So in terms of what can I do? Can I touch any no, bush? No, no nothing. No, okay. No, no. Not allowed to improve your life. Okay. All I do is lean forward. Yep. And just play like 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 it like an axe. And you got plenty of strength, obviously. So, but don't whatever you do, don't hang on that tight. Just keep it open and just hit down. And don't don't risk hurting your your uh, your ligaments or your okay. or your wrists or anything. So just breathe nice and deep and, and put your weight on your front foot. Focus on hitting down and just, I think if you just go straight up and straight down, it's not a, it's like an axe. Straight up, straight down. See what happens. How, look at this. Don't go in. <laughs> I told you you could do a good shot from there. How good is that? Have you been practicing? Save my par. 
You're practicing out of the rough. I have to say, I haven't been practicing out of the rough. Not that sort of rough. Not that rough, no. <laughs> now I'm very, uh, it's a little uphill. And uh, I've got to get, I just, I'm going to enjoy this part because I'm going to put it up nice and close and put the pressure on you, okay? You're not taking any shots on this hole, are you? No, no. Okay. I just might need to put it in there. And whatever happens here, you know, you've been playing six months and I've been playing uh, a long time. So uh, don't tell anybody that you, you, know, you got me on the ropes. <laughs> We're playing off the stick. Keep going, don't stop. Oh, that's a good part. Yeah, look, I, I put some rate. pressure on you anyway. Yeah. Okay, you have, you have to now hold it to half the <laughs> hole, okay? <laughs> Okie dokie. Got quite a roll in this green. We're on the back section and it's probably 40 yards, 45 yards long, this green. Are you going to return my marker? Thanks very much, yes. <laughs> That's good, I'm, I'll make sure I get my money back. Hurry. Solid mate, it was a gimme in the match, okay? And really I probably should give you a, a stroke on a hole like that, <laughs> but I won't. I don't need a stroke. I won't mate, I'm playing you off the stick. <laughs> 